Today we are going to France. We'll be going to a town called Sarlat La Caneda. It's known as Sarlat and it's a medieval town. So I'll be taking a lot of videos and photos. So we're gonna take a train from Netherlands to France. We're walking to the train station. Say hi! <laughs> hi! <laughs> this is how Europeans travel. They only travel with one luggage. <laughs> like <laughs> one luggage for two people <laughs> and then this is how we travel two bags each two big bags <laughs> So our train route would be from Amsterdam to Paris and then Paris to Bordeaux. We've got some time here at Schiphol Airport before we get on the train and we're trying to check how long is the queue here at the airport. The staff shortage in Schiphol Airport has caused such long queues for departing passengers but there's a better place to check out which is the panoramic terrace. We're inside the plane, we need to get on the train, not an airplane. Come on, let's go. <laughs> We're up nice and early this morning and we're not gonna stay here that long in Bordeaux. We're gonna head to Sarlat today. On our way to Sarlat, we drove past some vineyards and the chateaus here are well known for producing the finest wines, which made us more excited to try some wines. We stopped at Bergerac town for some food and of course it's also start to enjoy a fine wine. This town is a beautiful medieval center. Both the locals and tourists like to visit the town. We're already getting impressed with the south of France. We also passed by a castle that we're going to visit during this trip.
Finally, we made it to Salat. I'll give you a tour of our Airbnb place. It's really nice. So first, I'll show you the living room. Another bedroom there, and then here is the bedroom. <laughs> then I'll show you the best view outside. This Airbnb place is really lovely and we're staying in the heart of Sarlat and later on we're gonna go go out and we're gonna go for a stroll. We got two bottles of wine, not just one. <laughs> well, we have to cater to everyone's tastes. Yes. <laughs> Sarlat La Canada is a gold hued old town with beautiful preserved medieval buildings. The town was built dating back in the 14th century of France and it's still very well kept. Fellow emigrators, they're also they also emigrate everywhere. They also immigrate. <laughs> yeah, they go from country to country too. But this is actually a monument to them uh, getting stuffed with food um, until their livers expand and then they use that for pate. This place is also a favorite location of film directors.
all these honey colored buildings and there are also a lot of secret alleyways and uh, secret squares it's so beautiful to walk around here you can just walk for hours and hours around here and just see these buildings all over the town about the incident we had when we were in Paris at the metro station so this place is well known to have many pickpocketers in the area and we have been made aware of this so we were transferring trains from Paris Gare du Nord to Montparnasse as we were getting inside the train there was a guy who followed behind really close to my partner he was like almost hugging my partner and pretending that the train was very full and in a quick moment, my partner's wallet got stolen. And my partner tried to talk to this guy, asking him to return the wallet. And this guy was talking to us back in French. And he was showing us his two phones. And of course, we could understand him. And then this guy got off straight away at the next train station. And there wasn't much you can do. In the wallet, there were bank cards, driver's license, and some cash, but it wasn't that much. So yeah, we reported this to the police. We couldn't believe it happened. But after that, we had a great time in France. We were amazed with the charming town of Sarlat, and French food is great. I would love to live there just for food. And the next video will be a tour that we did in one of the famous castles in France. Stay tuned. If you want to see more of our travel videos because we are now in a new country so I'll see you in the next one <laughs>